know what's spooky? A uh, dark house. You're about to find out. What? Oh, God. Is something going to happen? This is the Bridge of Elden. Yeah, it's very dark, isn't it? Oh, uh, do you smell anything funny? You. Uh-oh. What? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <gasps> Fire! Basically. Is he, is he getting... Oh, uh, it's oil. Are you gonna have to run, dude? Mm, maybe. <laughs> Start running, dude. Start running. Might not necessarily need to run, but... You might need to kill. Oh, God, dude. You're gonna have to jump off. This is how you get to Lake Hillia, huh? Get to swim. Oh, no, we're trapped. Get out of here now. What the box? Where did that come from? Get on, please. Uh-oh. Eh. Was that land? <laughs> <laughs> There's another! <laughs> oh, jeez. Welcome to Lake Hillia. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Well, what used to be Lake Hillia. Um. There's a little puddle left. Jeez, you were okay? Oh, you landed in the water. It's a deep fucking lake. Whew, that was a close one. Look, there's this puddle below. Totally called that. Lake Helia, but there's so little water. Sounds like the Spirit Spring should be here. Uh... I told you, global warming is a thing. Global warming. You gotta listen to me. Uh, ooh. Oh, is that our friends, the knights? They already got here? That's fast. Different knights. Oh, God. Oh, Zoraz. Zoros. He looks a little sassy. Oh, my water is gone. Oh, I'm thirsty. Mm. God, we look very good, though, with our sparkles. No mistaking it, I look fabulous. <laughs> oh, we return to our home, though. Who cares? So they can't return because they need the waterfalls to get back up? Alright, well, let's drown this house and put the I'm water in. <laughs> Drown like, the house? Yeah, who cares? Is anyone living in there? Uh, Probably not. My favorite character is... Oh, really? Not really. Where'd okay. he go? Right there. There he is. A clown? <laughs> he's not my favorite, but he's... Holy shit. Fire in Falby's water top land of fantastication. Fantastication. It's our grand bottom location. We... Hmm. Yeah, nice lake. Don't like to have more, I don't know, water. Did the Zoras who live up river do something? Or is it a curse and spirit that floats up around here? I don't fucking know, and I don't fucking care, okay? That's why you're too high. Put some- Woo! <laughs> Was that a customer? Yikes, it's a m m m m monster m m m m m m You know what's really scary? Hmm, RE7? Hell yeah, you wanna talk about it? Yeah, do it. Okay, so, I just want to say, like, the first second of that trailer, uh, like, where it shows, like, it showed some numbers, and, like, it showed an orange number, it was, like, a one. I, like, I, it looked like the orange font of Half-Life, mm. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> For, like, a second, and then I realized, like, what the hell am I thinking? This is that game ain't coming out. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> come on, <Adam. laughs> But, uh, that trailer was really cool. Like, the PT stuff. Yeah, okay, so, kind of so for those of you who don't know, it, uh, the, was, the original VR of that game kitchen. was called Kitchen. Mm -hmm. and I had no idea. I, I never looked. I never even seen that, and I still haven't checked it out. But, um, can you hit this again? Yeah, not yet. But, uh, yeah, so it was called Kitchen. Uh, and, and then they were like, oh, this is Kitchen again. Mm -hmm. And they're like, it even said that in the demo, right? Yeah. And then it's like, and then... They showed the game a little bit, and then right at the end, it was like, it started showing the logo. Yeah. And we were both like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, was, <laughs> so, so they changed Resident Evil 7 to first person. Uh, if you guys have played the demo, then you know it's, uh, people are still trying to figure it out. It's like a PT situation. That's cool. But actually taking more than one day. So you've played the demo. I have played the demo. Is it, so do you fight monsters or are you hiding? You are, you really don't hide or fight. Uh, but nobody- I don't- Solve puzzles? Not even really, it's kind of just like giving you- There's like a little bit of spooks, and Is it, it like jump scare spooks, or what are we talking about? No, like, uh... I think Resident Evil does a really good job of like, uh... Area. Like, like environmental? Of environmental fear. Yeah. Uh, and j like with like sounds, and like Resident Evil's always- Yeah, that trailer that. showed it off. That, like, I was interested in that trailer before they even showed like that. 
I think we both were. Yeah, I mean, oh yeah. Clash Resident, Resident Evil 7 logo. I was like, what the fuck is this game? At first, it. at first I was like, oh, it's just another VR game. And then I was like, this actually looks interesting. So you don't need VR. You don't need VR the full to play. Game? The, full, the full game, you do not need VR, but when the full game comes out, you can use VR. It is supported. Okay. It is supported. Yeah. But there was no date for the game. Uh, the character you're playing is just some random person. Yeah, I apparently. saw, like, were you walking through that? The house with a group of people? Because I remember, like, in the trailer yeah. they showed, like... So do you have, like, NPCs who are walking through with you? So, do you want me to tell you? Uh, sure. Or would you rather play it? Because, I mean, there's... It, it happens really quick. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I guess you can tell me. I, yeah. I mean, I do want to see it eventually. It's not a spoiler. We're, yeah. we're, we'll play it. Yeah. Um... Shit, am I doing this now? Are you flying? Is this... Oh. X... Is this Star Fox? <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> um... This is actually a perfect time to do it, because I don't really need to concentrate. I just need to not hit shit. Okay. Um... So basically, you start off and you're a cameraman for uh, this guy who's basically doing like a haunted house thing. Oh, <laughs> that's great. And uh, what happens is when your guy disappears, no surprise, right? Yeah. I'm about to get fucked up. Yeah, I, just, <laughs> I accidentally, I didn't think my wing was going to hit the wall. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, wow. That was my bad. Careful now. What do you think? We should do it again? No, I don't want to. Yeah. End of the game. Uh, but, um,. So you're you're it's three people. It's like the host, mm -hmm. you're the cameraman, and the other guy who's like the producer, basically. Is the host the guy with the tie? It's the only guy I saw. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, and he's an asshole, <laughs> obviously. That's great. And a coward. Yep. Um. So basically, uh, you're like looking around the house, it's like oh, it's spooky, and the producer disappears. I'm like what the hell? Mm -hmm. And so uh, you go, and you find a, a door that opens up. Uh huh. I'm kind of just giving, like, a rundown. Yeah. I'm not going to say, like, what kind of door or anything. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, and, and things happen? You you, you, you you climb down a ladder into, like, a basement area. Oh, okay. And uh, you find your friend, and he's just, like, facing a wall. Uh -oh. And you're like, what's up? Blair Witch shit. And then you, like, you pull him, you pull his, like, yeah, shoulder, shoulder back, and you pull his face out of a hook. Oh, wow. Like, he's, like, hooked through the mouth, kind of like a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, until Dawn? Yeah. <laughs> With, uh, who was that? Matt? I don't, I haven't played Until Dawn. But I'd like to. <laughs> Didn't you watch stuff on it? No, i never seen anything. I mean, really? I've seen little trailers, but I want to save it for when I get the PS4. You never really watch any, like, I don't know how, the what the fuck that game, like, I know what that game is, but, like, I, I don't want to look at anything else, because I want to be a Oh, holy experience. shit. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, my God, that's awesome. Yeah, I'm super you excited. You going into that game blinds me the greatest thing ever. I'm planning to do it with Ryan, so I'm super excited. Can I, like, come to one? <laughs> you could. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, so... So and yeah, then things so escalate from there, or yeah, the man yeah. walk through the... Bas basically, place. shit goes down, and you you and the producer get captured, mm -hmm. and uh, you're, like, tied up in a chair, and you're... Oh, like a house statue. Ooh. Uh, your friend... Your friend. The uh, the host comes and, like, starts cutting you out. Oh, yeah. And he gets... Uh, shit happens. <laughs> he gets hurt. <laughs> ba basically, shit happens, and then you have, uh, like, free reign around the house. That's but, cool. And then you have to solve puzzles to get out? Ho or? Hopefully, by this time... The episode comes up, people solved it because mm -hmm. I want to see the ending. Oh, really? Or, like, no any like so there's like an ending cutscene, but well, there, there's it. there's different endings to the demo, mm -hmm. and I don't think anyone's beat it yet. Or if they have, they haven't posted on Reddit or 4chan yet. So you have know? you seen any relation to the main Resident Evil titles? Like, is there I, zombies in the deal? Like, I have not, but there's sounds that like have suggested things, mm -hmm. and there's lots of theories going around. I would totally be fine with like a Resident Evil game that's like. Stars are just a thing, like, in the background, like, Leon's a thing in the background, like, all that shit is in the background, you're just an ordinary dude. I think that would be so awesome. There is there is one thing connecting it, mm -hmm. and you see a picture of a helicopter, and the helicopter has the umbrella symbol on it. Okay. that that That's fine. That sounds cool. But, like, there's been hints from uh, developers, mm -hmm. uh, the developer of the game, like, because trying to help people uh, reach the ending. Uh... <clears throat> And it's like, it's like, they've been doing hits like, oh, you need to look at that picture again, and like, oh, shit like yeah, that. Yeah. And there's, uh, I think the most infamous thing right now, uh, hopefully, once mm -hmm. again, once this episode comes out, it's, maybe it'll be solved. There's a dummy finger you find. Oh, yeah? And nobody's found the purpose of it what yet. What it used, yeah. And like, or what it interacts with, and like, people think there's secret doors around, and like, it looks like it's like a key. Yeah. On the bottom, but like at the same time, nobody knows. You can't melt it. Is the house big? It's got a basement, two floors. 
I assume. Yeah, it's pretty big. It's a nice size house. Interesting. And you don't go outside the house, do you? No. Okay. And then the, does the demo finish when you exit it? I assume. Or, like, supposedly. It finishes when you solve a couple puzzles, I assume? Yeah, okay. I wouldn't even call them puzzles. Alright. It's more like searching for items. Yeah, that's... Oh, she's cold! Give her your fur. Let's shave it off. Who does she look like? Uh, Patrick Klepek's wife. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Is that actually... I think it's her brother. Oh, okay. Wow. Um... You know what? Jump? I forgot how this part works. Do you want to continue our E3 discussion that's been going on for a couple episodes next time on Game... Uh, game... <laughs> really? Checkpoint. Really? <laughs> next time on Checkpoint. Next time on Game Girl.